Today, I'm just going to show you around this brand new IH630RL. Now, if you've been watching our videos recently, we did have two in build. One of them has gone, so this is the last one for now. On a Fiat Ducato, this is 6.3 metres long. We've got the U-shaped rear lounge in this. We've got your mid sort of kitchen and shower room and then we've got your swivel cab seats at the front. But really, really nice. We've just had the decals put on. This It's in the showroom now, of course, as you can see. So if you do want to come and look at this, you are more than welcome. Any inquiries, just give us a ring. Give Nicola a call on her mobile. The number's just below. Let's have a little look around this one. As you can see, we've got the wind-out awning on here. We've got your LED strip awning light, which is a lovely touch as well. Other extras on this, we've got parking sensors, We've got a TV in this, and it's got a sound bar on there as well. We've got the half leather upholstery in this, but if this doesn't have something that you do want, if you might want solar panels, you might want lithium batteries, tow bar, it might be an external barbecue point, external shower point, satellite, Wi-Fi, any of these things, we can add this, of course. It's brand new. We've just built it here. We can do pretty much anything it's meant. Let's go inside. So we're in the cab seats of the 630 RL now, and as you can see, it is the new Fiat. It's got the new Fiat steering wheel. It's got the digital readouts on the dash. We've got the steering wheel controls and all that good stuff here, which is lovely. Remis blackout screens on the windscreen, and we've got them on the cab door as well. So this whole area blacks out. Now we do have blinds and fly screens on all the windows in the rear and on the roof lights as well. So you can totally black out the van. If you're out in summer, you can obviously have all the windows and the roof lights open put the fly screens over and you're not going to get bitten by the mozzies, which is lovely. Wardrobe up in here, we've got the wardrobe there. Your table pole for the rear lounge is just in here and the tabletop is in the shower room, but really good space in here, hanging all your clothes and all that good stuff. Now, if you prefer, you do have a hanging rail in this, we can shelve that out if you prefer. If you're not taking clothes to hang, you can, you can partition that off and use that space in other ways. Now, fridge freezer below, uh, three-way fridge freezer. It does open that way, and which is cool. It opens that way as well. You've got your freezer box in the top there. As I said, it's a three-way. It'll run from mains, it will run from gas, and it will run from 12 volts while you are traveling, which is nice. Let's move down. So we're in the middle of the van now. Now, first thing that we'll come across is you've got the hot plate on your cooker, you've got your three gas burners, and we've got your oven and grill below. And then just next to this, we've got your sink, and we have a draining board on here as two. Just lift up the tap there like that. It's obviously hot and cold. Um, and drawers beneath now, the drawers are great in that you can put things in here, rather than having cupboards, you open the door when you've been travelling, things fall out. You've, you've, you've got these, these drawers with the, with the partition cutlery unit in there as well. And then we do have storage above and of course all the way around your U-shaped lounge. Uh, this is a nice, we've put a new design in here, so you've, you've got the sort of matte finish on this and, and you've got this lovely grain effect cabinetry which is good too. And then moving back, of course, we've got your U-shaped rear lounge. Now this can be used as single beds or you can pull it together and have a massive double. I like it that you can do both. It might be that we live in England at the end of the day. It rains a lot. It's nice to have a settee each. You can you can obviously got your own size. If you do use them as singles, you're getting up in the night, which is, which is nice and simple. Halo lighting above me. We've got the LED spotlights and we've got this halo lighting above, which is dimmable uh, just above here. Obviously we've got everything burning in the showroom. Obviously you don't have to have all the lights on, but what a lovely, bright, classy place to be. Okay, so we're at the rear of this 630RL right now. We've taken off the rear doors on this, so as you can hear, uh, we've shed quite a lot of weight on this. So this is going to affect your payload. You're going to have more things you can put in without going over your three and a half tonne. Now, in here, we've got a good garage space in here. We've got a touch light there. Your awning handles just up here. The space in here it is quite vast. It's, it, obviously, your arm might be restricted with height, but you can get your chairs, your tables, your hookup cables, everything that you need, your essentials in here. And then storage goes right down under your bench seat on the passenger side. Um, maybe put your bedding under there. It might be that you've got long things to go in there. I don't know. But as I said earlier, we've got parking sensors on here as well. Let's have a look around the front. If you do want to view this brand new IH630RL, of course, it is in the showroom, as I said. We're here Monday to Friday, half past eight, till five and we're here on Saturdays as well we're here 10 till four give us a ring call the office on 01977 677 or ring Nicola directly on her mobile which is just below this one's up for 88,123 pounds it comes fully taxed it comes fully fueled you have a brand new hookup cable we'll look after you obviously it comes with all your warranties and everything else but uh, it's gorgeous it won't be here long don't leave it too long thanks very much for watching take care